Welcome back to the Fossil Academy. So tonight what we're going to be working on is this one, I think. This one's for Daryl. Got to just check the middle with the air abrasive. If you look here, the calcite, I don't know you can see it, the calcite smashed a little bit there. So just a little bit of gentle abrasive to see if we can get the middle looking a bit nice. And then what we're going to do is from here dish it all the way around so we get under it and there's a little another little baby one sticking out the top there so try and get that try and get that something like in the next next hour or so because i'm not going to be in for long let's crack on I mean, it's not too bad. A little quick waz with the air breathe. It's not the nice. It's not the nicest middle in the world. But what we'll do is we'll crack on with the pen work and see if we can just buzz it out. Cheers. Why I'm going to do though, I'm going to take it. A lot of people uh, make the mistake of just buzzing up to the amp. I want to get right under it so i'm going to start here i'm going to panel a line there that's going to be my my sort of dish point and i'm going to do that uh pan this hopefully get this little bad boy out as well but yeah try and get rid of all that rock middle's not amazing but daryl it is what it is in it mate it is what it is this one is for daryl i forgot his business name jekyll and hyde Jekyll and Hyde. It is Jekyll and Hyde, I think. Jekyll and Hyde artwork. I don't know, mate. I'll I'll put a link in to his thing. Uh, he makes some absolutely incredible. Like if you come to the Charming Heritage Coast Centre and you see that massive plesiosaur um, at the, in our education room, you know that is that's made by Daryl. It's brilliant. I was going to say he's like. It's not like Rolf Harris. That's that. That's wrong, isn't it? It's like uh, Tony Art. It's like Tony Art. It's a Tony Art. Yeah. That's what he's like. He's like. Is he makes some absolutely incredible things. But yeah, get this pen down. Get it looking nice. Get it dished out. But yeah. See how it goes. It's not the most amazing quality fossil, but that's the thing. When you're cleaning fossils, it is what it is. You know, if it's there, it's there. If it's broke, it's broke. If it's broke before it's fossilized, it's broke before, before it's fossilized. So, you know, it's potluck. But yeah, this one, it's not looking too bad. Yeah. Yeah, a bit moshed, but yeah. So just cleaning this one out. There's a little one on the top just here and he's all moshed up and crushed. So I'm gonna just, that's the thing you have to do. I mean, it, you could see that there was a, a body chamber there, but you know, if it's not there, it's not worth keeping, not worth cleaning. So I'll just waz that one off and it's just gonna be a little asty sat there. So yeah, but it's not there. 
Uh, and that's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes when you're prepping fossils. You, you know, you have to make a decision to get rid of stuff when it's when it's not good. Do you know what I mean? There's no point in keeping it. So, yeah. Yeah. See how it goes. There's no point in keeping it if it's rubbish. So, yeah. Do that. Smooth it off. Should be good. Sorry. I'm done with that to be honest I'm so shattered as well I reckon uh, that's me for the night give it a quick waz with the abrasive tomorrow Ooh, but yeah happy with that shame about that little one on the top bit rubbish but yeah it's all right jobs are good un. anyway on that note boom see you later that was just a quick vid just something to do in it but yeah still got that big one to do i did say i remembered the other day i was like oh, i'm gonna go with it but no i said that i weren't gonna uh, put that video out until i get 500 subscribers so i'm gonna start it but i'm not gonna show you i'm gonna keep it under wraps until i get 500 but yeah game on boom subscribe laters